Hello everyone and welcome to what I believe will probably be the first video of 2020 on this channel and yes I know it's nearly February but welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. Uh, today we're going to be doing something that um, came out I think last month. We're a bit late to the party with it. I had some issues and I wasn't able to attend the actual press launch kind of event thing for this that they did. Uh, however it's here now, and I'm here now, so we're going to give it a go. Battle Royales are something that I really do enjoy. You remember Dave or Jake from the old GTA Top Gears? Uh, we do enjoy playing the odd Battle Royale. Uh, he doesn't really enjoy Forza that much. He, he's not so much into cars as, as I am. Uh, however, I like cars and I like Battle Royales, so let's give this a go. Finding a session. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's going to obviously take time. So, um, let's just have a jump cut. So, like every battle royale, I believe we've got to find a spawn area. Let's go to the drag strip, because I like an airfield. Here we go. Right, so, if you've never seen this before and you're brand new to the whole Eliminator Forza thing, the way it works is a bit different to your usual battle royale. First off, you don't jump out of a big plane or battle bus. You can choose where you want to spawn. Secondly, there's these. So if I drive into this and claim the car. There we go. So I'm now going to upgrade my Mini to a Scubaru. Very nice. So the way it works is I've now got to find people and race them. So instead of shooting them or trying to kill them with a pickaxe and buildings, I can now go up to someone, beep my horn, like so, and now I have to race them to said destination, which is going to appear over there. So, here we go, 2.5 miles to go, he's in a mini, I'm in a Subaru, and at the moment I'm struggling to catch up to him. Here we go, okay, we're going to go for a jump over the motorway, and we're in the lead. Okay, hopefully we can uh, take this to the finish and win. I did get quite lucky actually finding this. However, that mini is gaining. Or at least staying within a close proximity of me. We're doing a solid 100 and 110 miles an hour as I try and avoid the trees there. As we go through some more shrubbery over a train track. And watch out for the hay bales. Less than a mile to go. This guy is hoping for a miracle. Which could still happen. I am rather incompetent. Um, as we're seeing right now. I should have done that. Don't hit a tree. Oh god. Oh god. There's the finish. No. No. Come on. Okay, I think I've got him. Brilliant. So I won. I don't know why we're waiting. I, I came first. And I got an achievement. Fantastic. Um, a Warthog or a Mini? I mean, when you're given the opportunity to go in a Warthog, you're not really going to say no, are you? Look at this. This is what I'm talking about. I'm not even a big Halo fan, but this is a pretty damn cool car. So, we've taken down one player, now let's go try and take out another. I don't know when the arena's shrinking, it's saying on the top left that it is. Let's have a, let's have a gander on the map, shall we? So, okay, so we're coming close to the border. So there shouldn't be too many people around here. Let's try and have a look for some more car drops, actually. There's a guy over here. What do we reckon he's in? Oh, okay, I reckon this is a good match. Where's that finish line going to be? Okay. I got lucky with that one. So he's in one of those off-road, ice, Land Rover-y, trucky car kind of things. I know it's not a Land Rover, but you know what I mean. Oh my god, this Warthog is fantastic! The only issue is I'm worried I'm going to hit a tree! Okay, big air, big air, land it, fantastic. Keep her going, keep her going, keep her going. Someone's in the TG Tractor I just saw there, that's new. Okay, 150 miles an hour nearly. Big jump coming up. Land it. The issue with the whole eliminator thing is you can go in a straight line as the crow flies, but then you risk crashing into a tree. And that is how I feel you win or lose this thing. I believe there's an achievement to win this in the original mini. If you do that, then, um, well, fair play. And that is another one knocked out. I wonder what it's going to give us now. So it gave us a Warthog from uh, from the first race. This time it's going to give us the option of Nissan GTR. I'm going to take it. Might be a stupid option. Might not be. We've now got a fast supercar. 
or GT car. Could be a mistake, I'm not too sure. What's this guy? This guy's in a race. It's a Mini! Someone's still in a Mini, fair play. Now the issue with this car is, whilst on the road, it'll be phenomenal. Off-road, I'm probably gonna struggle. So I think we're coming close to the arena wall here. So, what do we do now? We just go back in, look for someone? We could hide. I'll be honest, I'm starting to regret my choices of swapping out from the Warthog. I mean, I think they were the same level, or this is a level higher. Oh, there's a car drop over there. What's this? Let's have a look what we've got here. So, as I was saying, you don't kill people in this, you just race them. This is the 6x6. Six six. What level's that? It's a level 4. Mm, I'm going to pass on that, mainly because I'm in a level 8 car, and I feel that's a bit of a downgrade. So you don't kill people, you obviously race them, and then when you win the race, you get rewarded with a better car. But there are those car drops around the map. A bit like a loot box. I'll be honest, I'm a bit worried. There's 32 people left. I'm going to hide it out for a little bit. I've only played this... Oh, God. Oh, God. Please don't be a good car. Just be something crap like a mini. Oh, for God's sakes! Okay. I've got a bad feeling about this. So I'm going to try and stick to the road this time. That noise is ominous. Out of the way. Wait. Can you hit me? No, you can't. Okay. We're staying on the road this time. I don't want to bin it, because I feel like if I do, that tractor's going to absolutely demolish me. Uh, 2.5 miles left to go, according to the minimap. We're going to try and go for a shortcut here. Oh, this was this is bad. Right, I can't afford to cock this up. He says, taking a big risk. Going off-road. Oh, my God. Okay, don't hit that tree. We didn't hit the tree. Okay, good. Come on. Watch out for the bridge. Foot down to the floor. Okay, the tractor is still a fair bit behind me, but that thing must be a monster off-road. Wait, he's telling me I've got to go in here. Oh, no. This isn't good. Come on, Nissan. Please. I don't know if a Nissan have ever done a GTR rally car, but if they haven't, then now is a good time to do so because that is yet another win. What are we going to get this time? What's the options? An Aventador! <laughs> okay. Now we're going up in the world. Oh my god, the achievements popping left, right and centre. As I told you, I've, I've not really played this game much. This is literally my third go playing it. Um, and now we await someone else. Okay, so we're shrinking into this size. See, this is the thing. I've got a really fast car, but most of this map is off bloody road. There's 22 people left. Same scared's an understatement. I'm gonna go hide. See, the thing is, this is still quick off-road. It's just the jumps. I'm not gonna be able to handle as smoothly as as the actual off-roading vehicles. I think I just saw someone on the hill. I can see someone on the hills over there. Stay away from me! I don't want to do another race. I'm happy with what I've done. I just want to wait until the last one now. Oh god, there's someone over there. There's a car drop there. What's this? Level 2 Galavant. Yes, that's... That's what we want. I just don't want to be caught now. I feel like the next one's the final race. Well, I know at some point it just does one final race. What happens if I go outside that area? Do I just die? I'll be honest, I don't really want to find out. Oh, there's a guy over there. There's a guy over there. Run away! Run away! Has he seen me? He's seen me. <laughs> I don't want to race you! Go away! Leave me alone! <laughs> I can just see his little circle! Go away! I'm going to bump into someone else now who's going to be in a better car than him or me. So I think I've lost him. Go away! Oh, God. Okay. We're going to face the inevitable. Hello. Ha 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 ha! Didn't expect that, did you? Yeah, the old... Um, switcheroo, I think? Right, this has to be the final level. There's nine drivers left. God, that arena shrinks fast. Oh, God. This is it, this is it, this is it. Let's go onto the road so we can get a bit more traction off launch. Keep moving. Where's the end? Where's it going to be? I feel like I should keep moving. It's probably the best way to go about this. It's going to be in the middle, isn't it? Right, here we go. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Sugar, I'm going the wrong way. Come on! 
4.6 miles. That's quite far. There's one guy miles ahead. Come on, Aventador. Okay, here we go. We're in sixth. Now we're in fifth. That guy is in a pretty damn good car. Going into fifth gear. Oh, this is going to be horrid. Right, I don't feel like going off road is the best method for this. Sixth gear. I'm going to hit a tree. This is bad. Go, 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 go. Sod this. I'm just going to cut the road. No, that's the river. That's the river. Don't hit the tree. Don't hit the tree. Right, we're going to have to go across the bridge. Where's the crossing point? There's one down here. Are you in a level 10 car? Come on, Lambo. Please. Is that Aisha's taxi? Bye-bye. Braking. Someone's going to use me as a brake. No, he's not. Okay, fair play to the guy. I'm going to try and squeeze him out, though. I think he's got the same engine as me. These guys are going this way. So am I. Oh, I don't think I've got this win. I don't think I've got this. Oh, he's trying to crash into me. Oh, that backfired, didn't it, Mr. Taxi Driver? Someone else has binned it. Okay. Come on. Through the trees. I'm in third. I'm in second. I don't think I've got the win. I definitely saw someone very far ahead. As long as something catastrophic happens to him, I might be okay. This is bad. This is dangerous. No! <laughs> oh my days! Second! Oh, we were in it to win it. We were in it till the end. Oh my god. Damn! Damn and blast. What are we going to get reward wise for that? 41,000 credits. That's not too bad. Not too bad at all. We're going to get a fair bit of influence as well. And that's going to be it, I think, for today's video. I don't want to stretch this out. I don't want to do two elimination, eliminator, game modes, whatever. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please do let me know. That was very good fun. Um, I really like Battle Royale style kind of games and Forza I do enjoy. I want to make more Forza Horizon 4 content this year. I don't want to make an update video uh, purely because I think I've got about two seasons worth of update videos on my channel. I don't particularly want to start season three. But yes, thank you very much for watching this video, guys. As I said, leave a comment down below if you want to see more stuff like this. If you want me to do more challenge videos in Forza, let me know. I want to get you guys involved as well. The Discord server will be linked down below. Um, apologies for inactivities, guys. Stuff's just been going on in my own personal life and, you know, things have changed. So hopefully uh, we can get more videos out in the future. But until then, make sure you're subscribed because there will be more content coming this way. I want to do more real life stuff coming out this year. But um, yeah, that's a subject for another day. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video. But until then, goodbye.